Good morning. I have an old violin, 307. This is an old German violin from around 1890. It is from the town of Klingenthal, Germany. It has been revoiced and restored, and it has a new lease on life. This is a wonderful sounding old fiddle. One piece back, back length is 13 and 7 eighths inches long. Has a new nut, new pegs, new fingerboard. Uh, it's been re-graduated, re-voiced, a good setup, prim, medium strings, Lisa E string uh, that sound great on this fiddle. Whitner tailpiece and Guarneri chin rest. All in all, a lot of work on this old fiddle of moderate value. However, I'll be selling it reasonable. Somebody will be getting a wonderful sounding old German violin uh, for a reasonable price, even though I did put, I put a lot of work in this little fiddle, but I liked it. I like the way that it looked and I like the one piece back and I liked its daintier size. This is a full size violin, but it's dainty. It's 13 and 7 eighths inches long, which is the length of a lot of your old Italian violins. And a lot of people like those, especially classical players. Uh, the, the, um, the length, the string length is um, 325 on this violin, which is slightly shorter than a full size, standard size violin. But a lot of people prefer this and they're looking for this size violin. It's not a 7 8 it is a full size, but it's just got a little bit shorter uh, length, a little bit daintier size overall. The scroll is neat and in good condition. Um, original varnish, does have one repaired crack here that's an inch long, starting from the base side F hole, top circle. So this is a nice old fiddle, one piece back. Tones are very clean and pure and sweet. Not the loudest fiddle in the world, but it, it, it does carry and it has a very pure tone. And I prefer a fiddle tone like this versus a real loud fiddle in your ear. But it carries as good as, uh, as any of them. So again, this is number 307, wonderful sounding little fiddle. It is from Klingenthal. It's more or less a Hopf style fiddle, H-O-P-F, even though this one wasn't stamped or marked. It is from that region, has the squared off shoulders, and it has been internally rebuilt to play and sound wonderful. It's in good condition, uh, and it has the right look. It's a neat old fiddle. So for bluegrass or old time or just simply 
sitting around the house playing waltzes, this is a great fiddle. Oh, I'll be selling it reasonable. I can't give it away because I have a lot of time and work into this fiddle. Um, but it was worth it and it, it, it turned out well. So this is 307. If you have any questions or you want to try this fiddle, please let me know. Thank you.